welcome back to another video on my channel. Today I'm doing something a bit different. I am doing my first diecast review. I have other videos on my channel about my diecast I have, but those are diecast showcases. They're a little bit different. They just show off the diecast with some music in the background. So um I'm doing my first diecast review and today I am doing Jimmy Johnson's Clash win. Um you can see it here. Uh, he actually has a win this year, if you forgot. Um, it was at Daytona. And it came with this card right here, just like all the other winner cards do. Has all the race information on it, all that good stuff. Started 13th and all that. And then you get this Lionel Virtual Garage card thing. Uh, nothing on the back. So... The reason why I got this diecast is because, well, there's actually three reasons. Um, Jimmy Johnson has always been my backup driver, my second favorite. So uh, I figured I had to get it with the new ally scheme. And um, yeah, he won this race. Um, the second reason I got it was because I was there. And um, third reason is because it could possibly be his... Um, his final career win. So let's just start getting into the diecast. Um so start out to the side. You got Goodyear, you got the contingency logos, NASCAR race car, the two tribute stickers, and if you look at the forty eight up close, you can see some dirt on there. Jimmy Johnson on the name rail, Exalta, Ally do it right. You have the A there. On the front, you got Ally, that crazy design on the hood. 48, on the racing stripes, Hendrick Motorsports, Camaro ZL1 logo, they're on the grill. Okay. On the roof, you got Johnson on the back windshield, roof laps, 48, Ally on the hood, Ally on the deck lid. Back of the car, Ally, do it right, Valvoline, Camaro, 48, ZL1 logo again, and the new 2019 spoiler, it is different this year, it's much bigger than 2018, and DIN number is number 92, which is pretty cool, because um, that was actually his rookie number in the Bush series, with Herzog Motorsports, and the owner of that team just passed away a few weeks ago. Okay, this side, Ally do it right, Valvoline, Exalta. Then you have this scratch over the 48. This was, I believe, the contact with Paul Menard on the final lap, or what was supposed to be the final lap. And you got um, NASCAR race car, Goodyear, and some more scratches on the side there. On the front, let's get a good look at that. So, um, yeah, I think this diecast is pretty cool. Um, this is the ARC version, by the way. Um, not the Elite. I do have a few other diecasts on the way, but, um, that's all I have for now. This diecast is pretty cool. Lucky I have it. Hopefully Jimmy can get another win in his career, and I don't have to say I've seen his last win in person, but thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.